So, so those are two things that I use all the time. The other thing I have running 100% of the time is another text utility. Um, and this idea has actually been around in some form or other forever. I only discovered it two years ago and it was, I'm like, why have I not been using one of these forever? And it's basically a custom paste board. Um, so, you know, Ooh. you can cut and paste and that's awesome. Cutting and pasting is a power skill. Um, but this can actually basically just give you a library of the last 100 or 1000 or whatever you set in the settings um, items within your pasteboard. So I just go instead of command V, I go command option V. Again, you can set whatever keyboard there. And it brings up an app that is called uh, Pastebot. And it gives you basically everything that I have cut uh, as text for you know the last couple days. Um, and which is great because sometimes you're like, oh, I know I cut and paste that two minutes ago. Or maybe you were on a page and you were like, oh, I actually want to cut and paste these four pieces of text. And instead of toggling back and forth, back and forth, instead of losing context every time, you're like, cut, 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 cut. And then you go to your other form on the other side and go paste, 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 paste. I, I use something very similar. I use it 200 times a day. Yeah. Love it. What's yours called? Ditto. Ditto. Uh, D-I-T-T-O. Great. It's free. It's not as powerful as that first one that you were, mm -hmm. you were talking about. The text editor? Yeah, it's text expander. Right, but Ditto is something which is like um, awesome. Ditto free. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Yeah, I, I actually find this, this should just be built into operating systems. This is just so ridiculously helpful um, on an everyday basis. And then, of course, you know, just because you're like, oh, what was that thing? You're like, oh, it was something about Cincinnati. So you just type it up. Um, and there, you know, it starts, it'll filter it out there. And then the other nice thing, once you start getting out there, is you cut and paste four things. You're like, oh, well, actually, let me just hit the one and it just go there. Or actually, uh, that was the sixth item in the list. And you just, it spits that out. So that's really nice just to be able to sort of, again, start moving faster. Can you make uh, sort of pin items so they're always at the top? Oh. I don't know. Um, I will say I'm not a power user with this. I haven't seen that feature though. Okay. One of the things I like with Pluto mm -hmm. is the items that I'm not going to use mm -hmm. five times a day, but I'm going to use it once a day right, for right. the next month. So I just want it stuck at the top. Right. That's a cool feature. Yeah, no, that's very interesting. And that starts making it more like that first tool I used, which is like, okay, here's a, my library of things I'm always using. Because you're totally right. Is there some overlap between some of these tools? For sure.